Hello again. This time we have another nice uh, feature of MySQL, which is uh, cloning a table. How can we clone a table? You know, sometimes we need to have an exact same copy of an existing table. By an exact same copy, I mean uh, the table structure, its columns, their types, the data inside the table, the uh, primary keys, the indexes, and everything else. Well, that's straightforward in MySQL. All we need to do is issue a, issue a simple command that give us uh, uh, issue a simple command on our existing table that will give us a SQL statement to create a similar table and then we'll load it with the exact same data from the original table. Enough talking, let's go back, let's go straight, straight away to the hands on. Now, the command that we need to issue to have, uh, uh, to have back the SQL statement to create that table is this show create table, we give, my ta we give our table name slash capital G and our beautiful and our beautiful semicolon show create table what it does is it, it shows me the SQL statement that I should use to create that table so I'll just do that on my teams table I'm going to clone teams table uh, uh, before that let me just have a show show you my table so far so show tables I have uh, fans table results table teams one uh, teams one table Teams table. Let me just drop, drop table. I was experimenting with this. Teams one table. Drop it, and now it's not there. Now let's issue the command that shows us how to create the teams table. And all we need to do is we need to copy this SQL statement from there up until there, or down until there rather than up. Copy it, paste it somewhere temporarily, and then what we do is we change the table name to our new table is its name is for example clone of teams table and then the exact same team ID with the same type team name the same type and the rest of it and with our pretty semicolon at the end don't, don't forget that notice that it's telling me actually here that I'm using an, the engine in or DP for my table uh, th there is a way of changing and altering th the engine but that's not very important at the moment that's very easy to use and very easy to configure and change using even the alter command that we explained before but anyway we copy that again now and paste it to create our clone teams table and if we do show tables now I'm using my up arrow just to uh, have a history of the commands show tables I can see my clone teams table and if I try to for example describe it it should have the exact same structure as you might expect as the teams table that's the clone teams table and that's the teams table and the clone teams table now is actually empty if I do select star from clone teams table it's empty as you can see empty set and from the teams table it has about nine entries if I still remember yes nine rows now the trick to copy everything from teams table into clone teams table is to do this we can use uh, our usual insert statement so insert into clone teams table uh, will give it all the column names team ID team name team captain establishment date in the right order that's very important and then what I do is instead of specifying the data values I can say select star from teams table what that will do is it bring back all the results from select star from teams table and insert it into teams table with the column names in the right order let's see how that works remember now that uh, my clone teams table is empty but if I paste that insert into teams table columns and select star from teams table issue that notice nine rows affected which means if I select everything from clones table what you expect is an exact game copy I'm, I'm sorry an exact same copy of my team table as you can see I hope that's uh, that's making uh, sense so far it's quite easy to do something that we might need to use from time to time thanks for watching and see you next time